Pictures, equations, graphs, and tables can be added to questions using the question editor. If the question editor window is not already open, double click on the question to open the editor window. Position the cursor at the location where you want to insert the picture. Choose Insert and Picture from the menu options. The Insert Picture window will appear. The default picture type is Bitmap or BMP. Click the Files of Type drop down box and choose the type of picture files you want to insert. The program supports most common graphic formats including bitmap, jpeg, tiff, and pict. Choose the folder to locate the picture file you want to open. When you find the file, double click it. The program inserts the picture at the current cursor location. When you're done, click record. The ExamView test generator includes a fully featured equation editor that is available when you enter or edit questions. The equation editor gives you the ability to lay out complex equations using over 100 mathematical symbols, dozens of mathematical templates or structures, and multiple formatting options. Click Insert, then Equation from the menu options. The Equation toolbar will appear. Use the Equation toolbar to insert equations. After the equation is complete, click Record to save the equation. The ExamView test generator allows you to insert polar, Cartesian, or number line graphs. Position the cursor at the location where you want to insert the number line. Choose Insert, Graph, and then Number Line from the menu options. The number line with the default properties will be inserted, and the Format Graph Number Line dialog will be displayed. Click New to insert a point on the number line. The new point window will appear. For this example, I'll type 3 in the coordinate text box. Click OK. To insert a table, choose Table, then Insert Table from the menu options. The Insert Table window will open. Indicate the number of columns and rows for the table. When you're done, click OK. Press Tab on your keyboard or the down or up arrow keys to move along the table cells. This concludes the training video for inserting objects into questions.